Hi there, this is Jason Dunn and this is a Zune 101 tutorial on setting up a new feature that came out with the Spring 2.5 update and it's the quality settings. So what you want to do is you want to uh, connect your Zune, you want to go into settings and then you want to go uh, down here to um, the conversion settings. Now, if you ever use Windows Media Player 10 or 11 with uh, like a place for sure device, you will be kind of familiar with this is, with this feature. What it is is it's a, a way that the Zune software will actually downsample the uh, quality of your music, allowing you to fit more onto the Zune. Now the way they've done this in the conversion settings is uh, they, they basically say that when a song exceeds source quality, convert it to device quality when syncing with my Zune. Now this is a little bit confusing because I'm not sure why they didn't just allow you to specify a device quality, but in essence the source quality goes all the way up to 320 kilobits per second. And um, depending on what format your music is in, you may need to set this uh, a little bit uh, a little bit lower. So what I've done here, since most of my music is 256 kilobits per second or so, I've set it at 192. And then what I've said is that uh, you know if basically if any of my music is over this quality level, when it, you sync it to the device, put it down to uh, 128. Now uh, you can leave that leave this this option selected. If you click OK, and then if you switch back to uh, and then if you actually try to sync something we'll see if this works switch over to device and then the status and what we should see here is it's going to synchronize this and now it's, see how it says that it's converting the song so what it's doing is it's actually converting the song to uh, a lower quality uh, audio file now I'm connecting my Zune 80 here so I will never actually you know need to uh, down sample my songs I'm happy to leave them at the higher quality setting but if you have a 4 gigabyte Zune or even an 8 gigabyte Zune and you want to fit a lot more content onto your Zune um, doing this conversion is a, uh, a good way to do that now you will lose some some audio quality so the best thing to do is you know do it with one album and then listen to that album and then you can decide uh, whether or not you think that the songs still sound good if they do great that means you can you know potentially fit two or even three times more music onto your Zune uh, and if you find that the quality level isn't very good you can go into the settings and actually uh, bump them up a little bit uh, to get a higher quality setting or you can just let, let them sync at the original quality. So that's essentially it for this feature. It's uh, quick and easy to use and uh, if you have any questions feel free to post a comment on the uh, this video. Uh, rate our videos, post a comment if you can and subscribe to our channel. Jason Dunn from Zune Thoughts. Be sure to visit Zune Thoughts for all your news and Zune reviews. Thanks for watching.